excuse me, of course I had to cough as soon as I hit the button. All right, another Ice Age booster box unboxing vid. Still looking for Jester's Cap, Necropotence, and Polar Kraken. So let's get Kraken. See what it did there? All right. Fourth card is the rare, it goes in the back. And we've got Vertigo, Stench of Evil, Keldron Sky Captain, Scaled Worm, Howl from Beyond from the Core Set, Earthlore. That Earthlore was a good card. Yeah, and it's not bad. Goblin Ski Patrol, Mountain Goat, Portent, Circle of Protection, White, Blessed Wine, Tarpan, Imposing Visage, Legend of Legions of Limdol, and the rare is Balduvian Hydra, which is well, this one's pretty good. You get put, you know, it's like you put head counters on it, but it only ever had. Uh, hmm. Yeah, it's pretty good. Yeah, that's a good creature card. That's a good big scary creature card. I like those. The simple man. Harold McNeil, You're such a one-note illustrator. Forgotten lore. The walking wall, that is a really dumb illustration. Anarchy. <clears throat> Touch of death. Scary sounding card. This is the old sort of primitive lifelink. Oak of the Pans. Foul Familiar, Lava Burst, Circle of Protection Red, Stone Hands. That is certainly a pair of stone hands. Jub Toad, Ray of Erasure, Wild Growth, Karavakan Sorcerer, Soul Burn, and our rare is a black, and it is Flow of Maggots by Quentin Hoover. No, Ron Spencer. Cumulative upkeep, so it's a lame card and cannot be blocked by non wall creatures. <clears throat> That's gross. All right. One more. You know what? Hell, I'll do. I'll do. I'm, <coughs> excuse me. I'm plugging along here. I'll do. Uh, I'll do two, uh, I will do three more after this because I'm going to do them quickly. <clears throat> then I'm going to get this box. No. So. Icy Manipulator. Tap target artifact creature or land. Not bad. Pyroclasm. Two damage to each creature. That's right up my alley. Thin Horn Bow. It's like an equipment. Goblin Sappers. Norit. He looks like he's wearing glasses, but he's actually not. That's just a reflection off of his nose. In case you're wondering, Ardark Car Unicorn, Bone Shaman. I think I mentioned this before, but I got this as a this is a freebie in like an issue of the Duelist that came out shortly before uh, um, Ice Age was formally launched. Pike Knight, draw a card at the beginning of next card. It's a nice little annoying card. Dark Ritual from the core set. It's one of the boons. Filgia. Not bad. Uh, Balduvan Shaman. Kravikan Fetish. That's a necklace made of eyeballs and ears. And you draw a card and you give some it's one one target creature. Balduvian Barbarians. Word of Undoing. <clears throat> it's like unsum Unsummon. And you get a little bonus if you have any white creatures that you own. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. And the rare is another black. It's a Necropotence. No, it's, it's Hecatomb. Hecatomb comes into play, sacrifice four creatures. Tap target swamp controlled to have Hecatomb deal one damage to a target creature or player. That's pretty good, actually. If you have enough creatures to make this worthwhile, you can basically use all your swamps to uh, do direct damage, which is something I would be all into. Yeah. Three more for this vid. 
I do have a cold, and I mentioned that before. I seem to always be sick because I have small children and I work very hard, so it's a bad combination. But I get to buy 20-year-old playing cards. Makes it all worthwhile. Dance of the Dead. Urza's Bubble. Let's uh, look at there. Ice Flow, land. Non basic land. These are always fun. Uh, tap target creature you control. You talk, tap target creature without finding that it's attacking you as long as Ice Flow wins untapped. The creature doesn't untap. So it's like a trap creature with an Ice Flow, as it were. Sabertooth Tiger, Wild Growth. <coughs> Excuse me. Death Ward. Battle Frenzy. Illusionary Wall. Howl from Beyond, Orcish Conscripts, like the uh, Colander Helmet there and the Beanie. Not exactly, you know, <laughs> somewhat anachronistic, but hey. Gorilla Pack. That's kind of a weak card, actually. It's three mana for 3-3, three, three, but the opponent has to have forests. So, and so do you. Prismatic Ward. Not bad. Mountain Goat, Dark Banishing. And a red rare is Dwarven Armory. Sacrifice a land to put a plus two, plus two count on a target creature. Use this ability only during upkeep. Huh, not bad. Alright, keep on going. Provokin Elementalist. Isn't he handsome? Wall of Lava. Diabolic Vision. What is that? The top five cards of your library. Put them onto your, into your hand. Dude. Bring four on top of your library. And, oh, put one of them into your hand. All right. That's kind of lame. Hydroblast. Keldron Warrior. Lindell's Cohort. I've seen that. Panic. Shambling Sword. I have to say, another repetition in this set so far, which is nice. Fear. Foxfire. Cooperation. Dopey Phil Foglio illustration. Pyroblast. Yeah, you got Pyroblast and Hydroblast. Or, you know, that's counter red spell, counter boost, a bell, or destroy permanent of that color. And I just spoiled the rare. Nice going. Brainstorm, Circle of Protection Black, and Chromatic Armor. Chromatic Armor comes into play, put a slight counter on it, and choose a color. Any damage dealt to target creature by that source of that color is reduced to zero. X, put a slight counter on Chromatic Armor, and change the color that it protects against X is equal to the number of slight counters on Chromatic Armor. Okay. That's useful. <laughs> it is. It's just... I don't know. Precious. <clears throat> All right, last pack for this video, and I've got to hurry because I've got less than two minutes left. Do 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 do. Nature's lore. Yeah, put it force into play. Very nice. Thunderwall, and after all, Keldrin Elite Guard. It's a very masculine-looking gentleman. Disenchant, Circular Protection, Green Bone Shaman, Pike Knight, Snowfall, Kravikan Fetish, Balduvian Barians. Can never get a repetition. As soon as I say something, Aaron Tree. That's a double-edged sword that ain't worth it. Plus three, plus zero, but it's the only creature that can attack. Good protect for protection, I guess. Woolly Mammoths. Orange Lots Ascent. <laughs> Fjords. Cumulative, cumulative upkeep, one blue, target creature gains flying flint of turn. All right, good for, you know, a short amount of time. Grizzled Wolverine. And the rare is Time Bomb. During upkeep, put a time counter on Time Bomb. One tap. Sacrifice Time Bomb to have it deal star damage to each creature, where star is equal to the number of time counters on Time Bomb. Not bad. All right, that's it. Six packs. This is a supersized video. And I've lost track of how many packs we have left, but there are quite a few in here, so I will have plenty more Ice Age videos to keep you entertained. Uh, thanks for watching, and subscribe if you have not done so already. Thank you.